everybody, welcome to another episode of Subnautica. Today in this episode, we're going to be gathering more resources. Particularly ores. We need, we need that. And the food, I think we're going to be fine. For, at least for a little while. By the way, I need to drink. Actually, it hasn't been long since I last recorded, so... <laughs> I do need to grab more fish. I need to grab a peeper. There we go. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. So we need to go and find some copper ore. Now I believe the copper ore should be in limestone outcrops, which we found a bit yesterday, but not much. Now. Watch the sides of the buildings, because there's, uh, there's an enemy here, remaining. predator here that, um, uh, kinda not good to run into and catch you off guard. Oh yeah, it blackens when you run out of air. Get, <coughs> get the surface as fast as you can when that happens. Got another one. Another one. Hmm. Getting better at that. Mess with mushrooms. Um, hey, come on, I'm not usually this bad at finding them. Oh, yeah. Found some of them. I don't actually know if those hurt you. Not an extra. Emergency. Fuck. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay, you guys didn't get a view of that at all, but I just ran into that thing I was talking about a few seconds ago. God, those things are scary. Yeah, let's, let's not go into these tubes. Hmm. <laughs> God. Yeah, a lot of these we need separate things. These I can't, I... Oh, I need to find uh, this ore. Yeah, a lot of this stuff is going to be gathering in the beginning, but trust me, we'll be moving on to bigger and better scene things soon. Warning, local radiation readings exhibit characteristics consistent with total degradation of the Aurora's dark yeah. matter drive core. A Six. quantum detonation will occur with a probability of 85.5%. Advise observing a one kilometer safety range. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, let's head back. This is gonna blow soon. I've gotten past this part, and this is not good. You need to be close to here, because soon an event will occur. And this event is pretty dang significant. You want to be in your life pod when it happens. Trust me in that one. Let's go ahead and craft basic materials. Now, if you craft too much, you don't have stuff, it will just not put in inventory and wait for you to have inventory space and then put it in. So, just keep that in mind. I'm gonna throw some of my titanium I just collected. Titanium is the basic resource in the game. We've got copper now. Looks like to change the medical thing in a bit. Before it just lit up, then flash. Hmm. Okay, what was it done? Okay, let me check. 
Right, I was making a battery. That you have to go over here. Put all this stuff together. There we go, battery. Now I believe we can start making some more of that complicated stuff, correct? Yes, the scanner. This is a very early game tool, but yeah, a handheld spectrograph scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvage technology and to record alien biological data. This is probably the most important tool you will ever make in this game. I have been put the key right there. By the way, I forget to tell you that to set set a key, to activate a lot of these, right click of course, like the flare to throw it. Right click. This is underwater source that will stay there. That will stay there and light it up. This flare right here. I forgot to mention that. I never use it. That's why I barely mentioned it. In this fire extinguisher, of course, hold right click. And, uh, so this, we're gonna have to go and scan something now. This is probably the most, Im this item right here. So, yeah, of course, you can set the like, which key by pressing numbers on the keyboard. Um, numbers on the keyboard, oh. and clicking it will just put it in the first slot. Clicking it in this menu. Of course, now... The scanner is the most important. It helps you learn about stuff here. Now, for example, I can scan this plant. Well, not that. Not that yet. But this, we can scan. You can see the progress bar. You have to hold right click. Ooh, actually, that's new. I like that. That's new. They didn't have that pop-up come before. I like that. So, and then adds this stuff. Alien life form, flora. And you can read about this. Spore bearing. And you read about this, pause and read it. I've already read that. Otherwise, I would read it myself. Since this is my favorite part of the game. I love going around to scan things. And you can scan, like, this... Metal salvage. And certain things about it. Now, let's... Emergency. Seismic readings suggest oh, no. that detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. The central dark matter reactor will reach a supercritical state. In T I want to see this. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Oh, God! Get it! okay to go out? Okay, it's okay. Yeah, it's trash now. <laughs> wow. God. Okay, that looked a lot cooler in the last snapshot. Remember, or maybe it was the same. Maybe I'm just being blinded. <laughs> God, that was scary, though. <laughs> it's BAM! Well, good thing that's over. I actually wanted that to be over, so we didn't have to... I didn't have to have... I don't have to have that on my mind anymore. I can explore it for you. You should always be in a certain proximity to your base, though. Okay, so let's... Go ahead and... Make some more items. We need some food. Okay, let's cook some. Let's cook a peeper. Peepers are really good. Peter cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. See, in the original, there was actually no way to cook. Or maybe there was, I just wasn't in survival mode. No, in survival mode, there was no way. Remember, so 
cured food as well. And I'm kind of thirsty. Do I, have, do I have any more bladder fish? No. Crap. Okay, that's. We need to go hunting for some more fish. But, anyways, you can scan pretty much anything with this. Now, if I can catch a peeper. Now, it saved your scan. Now, don't get too close to that kelp forest. That's where that predator I was talking about earlier spawns. The one that stalks that stalks at night. Of oxygen remaining. Hint. Hint. <laughs> Most of you hopefully won't get that. Unless people who have actually played that game prob probably are face palming themselves right now. I just made a really cheesy joke. Oh, bladderfish. Need you. <laughs> I don't know what that was. And there's different biomes also in this game. Well. Okay. I'm gonna cook myself. I'm gonna cook. I'm gonna make myself some water and then end off this episode. This has been a pretty eventful episode, and I hope you enjoyed the first couple episodes of our exploration into Subnautica. And I hope, hope that you guys will enjoy it, and I will keep making the series. So, these guys, please leave me a like if you do enjoy this, and subscribe if you're new to my channel. I upload videos often, so... See you guys next time. Bye.